Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Sure. The problem equal row and column pairs, Leet Code 2352, is a fun exercise in working with matrices. Let's go through the problem statement, approach, and a solution in Python. Problem statement. You are given a 2D integer array grid of size nxn, where n is the number of rows, or columns. Your task is to find the number of pairs, r, c, such that the rth row and the cth column are equal. Specifically, for each row r and column c, check if every element in row r is the same as the corresponding element in column c. Example. Consider the following grid. In this case, both the first row and first column are 1, 2, 3, and likewise for the second and third rows slash columns. Therefore, the output would be 3, since all three rows are equal to all three columns. Approach. To solve this problem, we can follow these steps. 1 count rows, convert each row of the grid into a tuple for immutability, and count the occurrences of each unique row using a dictionary. Two count columns, similarly, convert each column of the grid into a tuple and count the occurrences using the same dictionary. Three calculate matches, for each unique row, check if it exists in the row count and the column count. The number of equal pairs contributed by that unique row will be the product of its count in rows and its count in columns. Implementation. Here's how you can implement this in Python. Explanation of the code. One row counting, we iterate through each row of the grid and convert it into a tuple, to make it hashable, and count its occurrences in the row underscore count dictionary. Two column counting, for each column index, we create a tuple representing the column by iterating through each row and collecting the elements of that column. We count the occurrences in the col underscore count dictionary. Three matching pairs, we then iterate over each unique row tuple in row underscore count. If that row exists in col underscore count, we calculate the contribution to the total count by multiplying the occurrences from rows and columns. Complexity analysis. Time complexity, O, and caret 2 where n is the number of rows slash columns in the grid. This is because we are iterating through each element in the grid to count rows and columns. Space complexity, O, n, where n is the number of unique rows and columns stored in the dictionaries. This approach is efficient and straightforward, ensuring that we capture all equal row and column pairs in the grid.